Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. This is Darla Rose. Hi babes, how you guys doing? I miss you guys. Um, so today I'm excited. So I'm gonna be doing a review on the Egg Shows. Um, new. I don't think they're not released yet, but they're gonna be getting released very soon. It's their um vegan brushes. I'm super super excited. They came like this. I already took off like all the packaging and everything, just so I could go right straight into the brushes and not like struggle taking them off. But these are the brushes. So it's a 15 piece um brush set. And it's, like I said, it's vegan. So I'm super, super excited to try them. They had like a blue color or purple. So I got the purple set. I actually really love the purple set. So we're just going to be using a full face using these brushes. Okay, guys. So I'm going to say this is purple, like I said. Um, these ones do not have a number on them like the last one. So if I'm correct, I think their brush sets don't come with numbers. But individuals do have numbers because I do have some other brushes. And they do have like the numbers of them. So I'm going to go in with this big fluffy brush. And this is going to be perfect for just like all over the crease real quick. I'm going to be using the Jacqueline Hill palette. And I want to go into a soft color called Perfectionist. And we're just going to put this all over everything. Ooh, this is extremely soft, this brush. Like extremely. You know guys, I'm going to zoom you in a little bit closer. So I just wanted to zoom you guys a little bit closer so we could really see this eye look right here. Oh my god, I really love the brush. Like, it's so... So kind of more with... Oops. Um, I do want to say these brushes are super soft. And I want to go... Like, kind of maybe a soft look or maybe like a red gold look. I don't know. Ooh, that's soft. I like put that color everywhere so perfectly. That is kind of a soft color, so maybe I'm going to deepen this color up in a bit. And I'm going to go in more with this um, tapered brush, I guess, or like flat brush. I don't know what this brush is called, but like this brush. And we're just going to pack some color and bring it in there to make it a little bit more deeper. And I want to go in the color called Thick Skin. And we're going to just hit off all the excess powder. And we're just going to... Bring that in right there. Right here. So I'm going to put this actually in the inner and outer part. Like that. And then right here. Have you guys seen something in my background? I love my backdrop now. Like how it looks. It looks like so professional. I'm still kind of playing around with, with my lightning in this room. I actually have a lot of videos I'm going to be putting up for you guys. So this brush is super soft, and we're just putting that in the inner and the outer. One thing I do love about the brushes, guys, like honestly, truth is, I could just like put them on my eyes all day long. Like they don't stab your eye, and they don't hurt at all. They're just very soft, and you can always, it always like the color just always goes where you want them. I'm going with my first brush and just kind of. Buff everything out. Okay. Now I love this brush. It's like a little small brush. Kind of a little pointy. I love these brushes. Especially just to go in the inner and the outer part. Like to really deepen up a color. These brushes are so so good. Um, like I said it doesn't have a number. But it looks just like this. And we're going to go in that color. Mm. Let me see. I think I want to go in the color next a little bit. With Grateful. And we're going to put this in the inner and the outer color. These apply the color really good. They blend. They're super soft, guys. Like that's one thing I I'll keep I keep saying, but it's because it's honestly true. Like their brushes are just super soft. Like they don't stab you or nothing. And like I said, these are vegan. And it's a 15 piece set. I 
I, I don't know if you guys know or don't know but you guys could use my code Darla to get like some discount code I'm using that color next I'm just like very much just tapping it in there and then we're gonna blend it out and I'm gonna go into that previous brush I had earlier we're just gonna follow that up and around up and around And this palette and the brushes are working so good. Like they're just blending exactly how I want it to blend. Like nothing. We're not having no troubles here blending at all. Blending super good, super soft. Um, I keep saying, I need like a little hand mirror. Like a little hand mirror than this big one. But um, it's super pretty. Okay. I like what that is. It's kind of soft. It's kind of... It reminds me like a grudge look in a way. Um, so I'm going with this little brush right here. Like a flat brush. And I'm going to use this just to cut my crease. I'm going to cut my crease one crease on camera. And then I'll do the second crease off camera. And then we'll just do that. So we got my concealer and we got the brush. We're going to put just a little bit on our hand like that. And then we are just going to cut this in the middle. Okay. So let's do this cam this eye off camera and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so the creases are nice and cut both sides. I really like how they came out. Um we're going to get our Mario spray and we're going to wet this flat brush I have right here. And I feel like this is a really good like packing color, packing brush to pack on some colors. So we're just going to wet it. And we are going to go into the color called Bougie. We're just getting that color. And we're just going to put that everywhere where we cut our color at. So I am having a little bit of trouble getting this color on my brush. Just a little, okay, a little trouble. I have to kind of work with that color a little bit more. Oh, but that is such a pretty color. Mmm, that's very pretty. You can even go in with your, like, your finger and kind of like put that color on. It kind of reminds me of, like a rose gold color. We're just putting this all right there. Perfect. Now I want to go back in with that really tapered brush that looks really small. Just like this. And I want to blend this color. And so I'm going to use a color called Next and Crazy. And we're just going to just apply those colors and really blend them. Blend this look out. And we're just going to apply this into the inner and outer part. And a little bit on top. And that's going to really help this look look blended. And add some more color. Because I feel like the, color looks, the colors look a little too light for me. I think I want them to be a little bit more um, brighter. I feel like I use a lot of light colors. So I kind of want to bring this out a little bit more. Okay. Well, it looks pretty. I am going to go back with that one flat brush to kind of reapply the color because I feel like the, um, I feel like some of it came out. So we're just going to reapply this real quick. Very light like that. I 
And then let me clean this brush off. I'm going to clean this off. And then I kind of want to add this like, little white color on top to kind of bring out a little, a little bit more like that. Just down the middle like that. So I'm going to this color called I'm In It with the same brush. And I'm just going to apply just that white shade just down the middle like that. And it has like a little bit of like a white, white reflection in it. And that looks beautiful. Oh, I love that. So we're just going to clean this guys up right here. I'm going to take off this part. I'm going to prime my face. And I'm going to come back and do my um, my foundation and everything um, on camera. But I'm just going to clean this up real quick guys. And then we'll be right back. Before I do my foundation, I do want to do get this um, flat brush. And I want to do a liner with this. With this black color called Temptress. And Crazy. Oops. <laughs> you just kind of want to do something like that, like a little liner. I just want just a little bit like a smoky liner. Okay guys, so now we're going to clean this up and I'll be back for the foundation. <laughs> okay babe, so we're back. So these are the eyes so far. I think I might add a little bit of glitter, but I'll do it in a bit. Um, but let's just get right into the face stuff. So I'm going to spray my face. I reprime my face using my um, Wet n Wild Serum Primer. Um, I just wanted to get a little bit more moisture on my face. So I saw they have like this um, kabuki brush, I guess you'll say, like a foundation brush. So I really want to try this one. I actually really like their last foundation brush I used. And I actually used it. Um, so I'm super excited to try this one now. So we're just going to try it out, babes. I'm using the Wet n Wild um, Photo Focus Foundation. This is the dewy one. I really like dewy skin during the summer. And one thing I will say guys about brushes, I feel like they give you an actual, they actually do give you like a full, um, they actually give you a full coverage when you use brushes. And I actually kind of always forget that, that I don't have to use as much foundation. Oh yeah, that is doing it. You guys see that? Like that blended everything out so good. It doesn't leave no brush strokes or streaks. Sorry, brush streaks. Um, I also when I use brushes, I kind of do like to like um, bounce it a little bit too. But, um, there are no brush streaks. There's. Mm, I really like the coverage it gave me. It didn't like wipe off none of the foundation. It actually looks super, super good. They actually do really good foundation, foundation brushes. Because like I said, I'm not really a big fan of using brushes. I always like to use a sponge. But I tend to actually use their brush for my foundation. I'm just making sure I got everything. Now we're going to use our e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. I really do like this concealer. It's super good. Just going to do just a little bit like that because, see? I'm just doing that. And I have to be super careful because like I said guys, brushes do give you like a full coverage so they really do make stretch your product for for a lot of coverage and a lot of space 
Do you guys see that? Like how easy I'm just blending everything. I'm trying to tell you guys, I'm grabbing like the littlest, littlest product because it gives you such full coverage, the brush. It just, it really stretches your product. Like, look at how pretty that looks. Tell you guys, just like, put barely anything like that. And right there, it doesn't give me enough. That little dot right there is going to give me enough. Like, you guys see that? And this brush, look how much that brush goes. Like, it saves you so much product using. Like I said, I like to bounce this. I kind of like glide it too by bound it then I'll glide it mm -hmm. that is looking so pretty my skin looks so healthy <laughs> and we're looking real close look at that guys like really close can I see all that Okay, so it's time to set our face. I like to use an air spun. So I'm going with my air spun. I'm using the egg show brush. It's like this brush, it's kind of flat but poofy. And I like to use this brush to really, um, to like set. And with this concealer, I do not like to bake. I like to just set it because it's very um drying. That's also why I kind of go in with like a dewy foundation. And this gets the job done because it just it has like that little peep right there, that little point. So you could really get it into the eye area, up the nose, this is the slide of the nose. You could get it right here in these little corners. Right there. And this really like just melts it into your skin so seamlessly. You guys see how soft that looks? Like my face is so pretty looking guys. Like it looks so smooth, so clear. There's no texture. There's no pores peeping out. Like, my face just looks like a filter. It looks so smooth. Okay, guys, I'm going to use this big fluffy brush. And I'm going to use this to really set my neck. You guys know I love using big fluffy brushes for this part. Time to contour. So we're gonna use these two brushes. I think I'm gonna use this brush to contour, and I'm gonna use this brush to blush. So this is the contour brush, and then this will be the blush brush. Just gonna grab that in there, head off the exit. contour the nose I do have this brush I don't see no highlighting brush because these are like the brushes I have left is this one only and then some base some eye brushes so I'm going to use this to contour my nose and then I need to grab one of my own highlighting brushes because I don't see a highlighting brush that comes in here but yeah you could use this one that I use all over my eyeshadow as a highlighting brush but I like it more for an eyeshadow brush so we're just going to contour our nose. I really like how this brush is. It's like angled. See that? 
Nice. Let's go into with some blush. that out a little bit. <laughs> that came out a little too strong for me. Okay, guys. Okay, so that base is mostly done. We just need to do some highlighting right now. Um, I don't really have no powder to sweep off because I'm more just set than bake, so everything's already mostly off. So we're just gonna do that. Um, let me highlight my face real quick, and then we'll finish the eye look, you guys. So we are. So I'm just using their brush to highlight. And this is their brush. So, oh my god, look at the highlight, how pretty it is. Okay, guys, so we did that. We finished our face, we highlighted. Now we're going to finish. Okay, guys, so we're back. So we're going to go into this flat brush. And we're going to go into the jogging hip hop. We're going to go to thick skin. And I'm just going to do it in the inner and the outer, like that. Just like that. And then we're going to go into next. To make this kind of match. on, So we're making this match on top. And then, I want to go in with this pointy brush right here. It's a small little pointy brush. We're going to wet this because this is going to bring everything together. We're going to go into Bougie. And we're just going to drag that right there underneath. And then I'm in it like that. And look how pretty. So it should match to the top. And then I'm in it. And then we're going to put that color, I'm in it with that same brush. And we're just going to put this into the inner corner. I love small brushes like this because they just really put the color exactly where you want it. Like, you can get really precise in it with it. And that's always my favorite. Okay, babe. So we are just going to pop on some eyelashes, do the lips, and then this look will be done. So one, two, three. Hi babes, so we're back. Oh my god, this look is so beautiful. I love it. I love this look so much. I think it came out so pretty and how we achieved this look was so pretty. Um, these brushes work super, super good. They're super soft. I really, really enjoyed the face brushes. I really liked them. They were super soft and nice. And oh my god, the foundation brush was everything. Like, do you guys see how clear my skin looks? Like how smooth? So I have like a little bit of fall out from uh, <laughs> but you guys see how pretty this look is like my skin looks so smooth so just like like if there was a filter like this brush does so good like applying it it didn't leave it streaky or nothing so i actually really really like these brushes and like i said it was the 15 piece set and they're all vegan so hello that is amazing um i wanted to let you guys know that you guys could use code darla darla Oh, actually, I'll put my code for you guys right here so you guys can actually know what what it is. But, um, yeah, like I said, I love these, babes. I actually highly recommend them. Or if not, you could see one of my previous videos. I also did another review on the other brush set. And that one I love, too. It was amazing. It came with everything I needed. I did a full face with those brushes, too. So, um, make sure to look at that video, babes. Um, but besides that, yeah, I actually highly recommend these. And... I think it did so good and then my thoughts on the Jaclyn Hill palette it was a really good palette um, it blends really good uh, the pigmentation is there so yeah babes I just want to let you guys know I just want to do like a quick little view a little review a couple products but uh let me know what you guys want to see more of bye love you